I'm going to use the same word and I'm going to do different types of fonts with the same word so you can see the difference. All you need is to have legible handwriting. And that's the one thing that students have to understand. They're not going to know what the notes said if they can't read them. So I'm going to just use my uh, plain handwriting and write the word peace in all capital letters. Okay, I could be a title. It's legible. It's simple. I can make the word peace. with lowercase and capital. Now I'm going to add a serif. The serif is just something you put at the ends of your letters. This time it's going to be circles. Immediately I get a playful aspect to my word. If I choose straight lines, has a little bit of a different feel. Another font that is very um, helpful is if you do a double line on the leading edge. helps it stand out with not a lot of effort. And if you take a color that matches what you're doing, I'll just use gray here and fill it in. Stands out without that much effort. If you want to do cursive and make it look a little bit like calligraphy, a little fancier, you first draw your word and the muscle memory is key here. I want to go where I remember a descending line and I'm going to make it thicker. So I know this was thicker. I know this was thicker. Here. See how that's adding a bit of interest and a little sense that I had a fancy nib? Yours is probably looking nicer than mine. This thick pen is a little bit hard for me. I have the old fashioned bubble or block letters. Students love these also. Great for titles. You gotta give yourself a little more space for these. Now I'm gonna do a whimsical one. I've just doubled that little line and I'm adding a few dots. Use the same. There's lots of little tricks when you're doing lettering, um, if I wrote the word love, just by doing that, I give a sense of the word, the meaning of the word. I could add
So that's the idea of um, using different fonts. Um, another way to differentiate is just by changing the center line. So if we go high, or you could go low. 